We are here. Boom. Kaká will come. Look, she will escape. Okay? So now we're gonna do the same thing we did. I'm gonna stay on my knees, I'm gonna bring her. But once I bring to the side, you're gonna make sure you're gonna use her hook. So now I have the hook on bottle, but I have the other arm here to choke, okay? You can use the second hook if you want. So now we're gonna do the choke we learned yesterday. I'm gonna make sure my head's here all the time. I don't wanna let her escape. I'm gonna open the lapel, look. Open the collar, control, step, and finish. This hand, you can control the other collar. You can control here. I don't do this. You can do, but I don't do. Usually, I control the other, the other collar. Some people do this. Sometimes, it's a, if I feel it's a little bit loose, I come here. If I feel my grip is not deeper enough, I come here just to make sure I'm gonna cut more space. Okay, but what I prefer to do is control the other collar and squeeze your, your knees. So, boom, escape. Sometimes, look, if the person is still a little bit on top of you, come on top of my leg. If she's still a little bit here and you feel, you know, like she's blocking, you can use this hook up, boom. Okay, come, bring and hook. Now I have the hook, but I have my hand on the other side. Make sure you're gonna cut the space. She cannot put the hand on the ground. Okay, that's the most important. So use your head, open, control, step, and push. Yeah, many times I do this as well. Cause she will tap in the middle of the way, you know? But if she doesn't, you control the other one. <laughs> Sorry, Kaka. <laughs> okay? One more time, don't need. Fine, right? Uh, three minutes each one. I'm gonna pass it a little bit. One, two.